Uh, I'm gonna do one greed as Isaac because we need to make money. I gotta, I gotta pay the greed donation machine bills. Do I have a stream schedule? I would say, hopefully sometime. Um, but I would say I usually stream. Basically, I just moved and stuff. So, you know, I, I'm gonna work on it. I'm gonna try to just either stream every day or something. I don't know. I gotta figure it out. I'm trying to be more confident and less sad. But you can count on it, maybe? Oh, Pinking Shoes is really good. Oh, I wanna use it. I don't wanna re-roll it. Believe it! Believe it! Believe it! Believe it! So believe it! Then believe it! Believe it! Okay, believe I'll do this. It. Believe it! Believe it! Believe it! So believe getting hit twice here. I'll always shout that to the heavens. Use your iframe right here to get a second hit. For free. So effectively doubling what you're paying him. Or cutting it in half, right? Oh, I I don't blame you on that. Wow, that's not great. I'm gonna believe in this pill. Oh no, please. The first floor of greed is always the most brutal. Thinking Shears is gonna save us. Basically, I was counting on that dark bomb to give me something. No sin ropes? Greedy. So what don't you like about greed? Oh, not that I, I'm not saying you're wrong, but... Pinking Cheers. So Pinking Cheers, as you can see, it cuts your body from your head and it just eats away the enemies. Especially on bosses. So I'm just kind of flying my head around. We can actually cut our body twice. Get him, Pinking Cheers. Let me hide on this rock real quick. Let's see. Oh, appreciate it. Yeah, I, um, I've seen him play quite a few indie games. On my roommate slash, like, friend Kevin guy thing, what, whatever we are to each other, he's definitely a Northern Lion guy as well. So anytime a new indie game comes out, I'm going to hear about it through him, probably. So I'm, I'm going to believe that my Devil Deal is trash, and I'm not going to bring my D6 in. Normally, what I would always say is your number one goal is Devil Deal, right? And then you also want your your D6 to reroll that stuff. I'll take that. Oh, that's gonna kill me. Woo, scary. No telepills, please. Luck down. Feels like I'm walking on sunshine. Thanks. That's not great. Oh, let's see. It's not really. Oh yeah, greed greed mode. It's up and down. Um, let's see. I'm interested in the bird in the hand, so I'm gonna do this. There we go. I'm gonna take, I have a key, so I'm just gonna take this and go to the next floor. Probably with the complete Borderlands customs. I'm a Borderlands gal. Yeah, um... I want to say it's something with, like, an... an mm, I, I'm trying to remember the character. Uh, this is Stompy? Yeah. What is it? Does Stompy let us break rocks? Let's take a look. I don't want to step on that. But that would show us. Uh... Oh, okay. So you spend too much in every floor? So for me, I didn't spend my money last floor to then have items, you know, like... This is better to me, so now I can spend my items on better. I guess it's like I'm treating the next floor as a reroll, you know what I mean? So I just want to try to prioritize better items. But can't really do much with what we've got so far. What's our best our best item is Gimpy, you know? I'm always gonna say back up. Just keep backing up from enemies and give yourself the space. I'm going to try to focus this down real quick. These guys are like a low tier threat. 
I feel like they're more threatening with their, their heads cut off like that. Because they can spawn creep in that bottom version. So the second one, not so bad. I'm going to use that right there. Because as you see, we get black hearts from the circle. Basically, we get hit. We get benefits. So Gimpy should give us hearts. And then using that spear on enemies to kill them should give us hearts. Uh, I love the reroll machine. So when would I use it? Well, I'm going to use it more in the normal game because you don't have bombs here. And the more money you put into your reroll machine here, the less money you have for items. So with a finite resource like money, I don't want to reroll a lot. But, you know, you do have to get a good item eventually. So I guess I want to live around my D6. Uh, we picked up both of our items. It was Stompy and then below that we got the bread. So there's nothing I need to worry about re-rolling. Oh, that sucks. So my priority is going to be um, Devil Deal re-rolls. Uh, I'm interested in this. And I'm going to leave enough for an item. I would also maybe value a key. Man, I can't believe I did that. I don't know why this, this attack is, like, shocking me today. I guess it's just the champion version. Do you have a least favorite boss? Box would be low-key good, true. I like, um, Fanny Pack as well. Oh, come on. I like speed a lot. I value speed. I would throw away something with some speed right now. I'm looking for you, Laser Baby. I know you're out there. Oh, Mask or the Adversary? Good, good, good taste. The Adversary feels like just free hits on you sometimes. Pretty rude. I'm gonna go through this real quick while we can take advantage of the Red Hearts. Tiny, we're tiny. So I'm still not seeing any damage items right here. This would make me even smaller, so that's funny. Oh, it's placebo. I'm trash. I'm gonna re-roll that probably. What killed itself in here? Oh. I just wanted to be really small. Oh well, that's pretty cool. So it looks like the red poop. <laughs> Absolutely. I'm gonna do that again. Jump right here. Oh, it didn't work on this one. I wonder why. That was pretty great. I guess it's like spawning on a rock. Oh, appreciate you, Tux. Are you streaming tonight? It was cool for the variety show last night. Tux here does retro games. So, I, like I was saying earlier, I'm N64, so I didn't get to play a lot of the games that Tux plays. Uh, that's only our first piece of guppy. And we're not on Devil Deals. Right? No, we are on Devil Deals. Ugh, I still would rather reroll this one. Wow, that's not great. The the gross. I mean, growth, growth hormones is pretty good. I like that. But we'll just take our key go the next floor. This is... That's what I figured. Not going to give us any nice money. Oh, in a few minutes. Okay. Well, thanks for stopping through. I just want to go through without getting shot by these red fires. Oh, true, we can walk over rocks. Little haunt. You know, we can stomp them rocks. Stomp the yard. Hey, I'll take it. Well, poor timing. I just spawned new enemies. Damn, little haunt. Probably okay to leave those guys. They'll just kill other things for me. Now there's too many. I'm gonna try to lose more red hearts. Not on purpose, but if I do, and leave the, the black hearts. Oh, 
we're gonna probably end up positive with the, with the HP. Um, favorite item. I'm gonna say Brimstone. I think it's just so safe. Because if I'm going to a Devil Deal, what am I really looking for? I mean, you know, Death's Touch is cool and all, but it doesn't, like, win for you like I think Brimstone does. Because it's just so safe. I think technology is kind of, you know, more... I think I favor extreme range and giving myself reaction time. Oh, man, I can't get this. That's brutal. I could bomb that, but that's not worth it. We need damage. There's damage. There's more damage right under that. So, let's take care of that. Oh, I really need him to bomb this. I guess I could have pushed that myself. Oh. Thank you. Oh, please. Not like this. No, I'm bad. I'm, I'm, what is it? I'm tunnel visioning for this one heart. I want it so bad. Interesting. So, yeah, it is just going to hold it there. That's great. It's like a stun. Toy milk. Oh, my God. Didn't I? Oh, right. We had a run where I picked up Curse Eye and I didn't even know it. That's how well we were doing. Please, Bomb, please. I'm just going to try to generate some HP here. So basically, I'm just trying to trade red hearts for this, for the good stuff. Okay, we got enough now. So, more damage. I'm getting a little worried, so on the next hit, I'm going to pick up HP. I'm just going to pick it up because I'm not going to get hit at all. I'm too good. That's my real plan. Um... Because I, I, even something like Sacred Heart, which is like more rare or whatever, I don't feel the excitement that I get, I guess, like for Brimstone. Because Sacred Heart is the range down. Palming's pretty good, though. Um, but like Brimstone, Loki's Horns is a like a better free Krampus's head. So I appreciate that a lot. I think this is my favorite version of this boss. Um, I've tried to use the bomb because of muscle memory there. Uh, just because you can just attack these little hearts. Wow. Sure did bop the hell out of me. You can just attack the hearts to do damage to it instead of having to shoot the back. Oh, you don't like technology? Okay, Brim Spoon. Brim Spoon is amazing. Brim number one, also great. Krampus, is that you? Ooh, very cool. We do this. I messed it up. I should have used it once, but it's fine. Still don't know what Shade does. So I wanted to use that once for HP and then do that. I got too excited. Oh, the purple beam. Oh, go ahead. Yeah, I basically just, like, so I also grew up on, you'd probably know, like, Cobalt Streak and Richard Hammer. So I'm just not, like, watching if they do, you know, Isaac. You can tell me about stuff. Okay, that's great. Oh, that's funny. I was hoping for Balls of Steel. I'll be honest. Alright, let's see how far we can get. We're not getting flummoxed. All these red hearts. Oh, I suck. Don't worry, I have double damage now. Actually, we'll have more than double. We're gonna pick up meat. 
Oh, pajamas is great. Oh, interesting. It makes you restart the those previous waves. I guess I didn't know that. So if you did like all the waves in a row and you die, you have to redo from the start. That's rude. Mom's mascara. Mm, it's okay. Pink bream. Oh, oh, okay. Let's see. Oh, two. Man, no luck. I'm trying to generate HP off of that. But we'll get pajamas and we'll be okay. Use brimstone, guys. Not nice. What do you do, Shade? What do you do? I wish you were Dark Bomb. Oh, well, I walked right onto it. So you just want to slap as many people with that dark circle as possible. Um, the speedball is pretty good. Um, you pick this up. We're gonna do this over and over. Let's also do our little, uh, what is it? It's gonna keep spawning things for us. Artificial insemination, that's what it is. Um, sure. I still do want a key, though. Oh, Shade follows your path and damages... Uh, okay. So it's kind of like, um... It's all the weird attack line moves and stuff. I appreciate that, thank you. For real. Oh yeah, the brimstone ghosts. I still think I like them. Oh, wow. I took damage. Nobody makes me bleed my own blood. I'm gonna try to make sure I focus the same guy here. Don't split the... Don't split the damage. I think these guys are pretty spooky because that, that's why I think they're pretty spooky. This is fine. Using a DOT of damage over time team, it's got an effect that reads at the start of an enemy's turn, all DOT. Oh my god. An extra time. Ooh. That's quite strong. Hey, DMT paid us out. But you see, we got two hits there, but we got three HP out of it. That's what we're doing. I had a feeling I should have left, whatchamacallit. Let's we'll take this. I could have re-rolled the item that was sitting over here. I guess I'll pick this up, just so we have an accessory. No key rip. Oh, well, maybe we'll get two cents right here. No way. We got the Gersey beams. But I feel like this is a... I'm struggling on this one. Well, nothing to worry about spending money here. Well... I'm going to re-roll it into Magic Mushroom. You thought I was going to take a bad item. No way! Only good items for me. Okay, Mass and Hearts. That's annoying. Oh, Shock, Wind, Fire. So, basically, you're, you're double stacking it. That reminds me of a skill in Underrail. In Underrail, there's a skill called Temporal Manipulation. Uh, and it's essentially, like, as I understand it, this could be wrong, but when you're, like, using it on somebody, essentially you, like, freeze them in time, kind of like stasis, and, like, when they unfreeze, the difference between, like, them and then them in the future when you, like, unfroze them basically, like, breaks their body. It's like existing in multiple plates, places or planes or spaces. It's a cool skill. I guess the fear made him do that. Ooh wee! That's rude. Didn't see too many normal attacks. I feel like bloat spams the lasers the most, so I try to plan around that. 
Oh, um, I've played Destiny. I played both of them. I played the first one on PS3 a little bit. I like picked up the Super Bundle back in the day. Um, and then I have Destiny 2 on PC. I just haven't played in a long time. That's great. So we're gonna do this, and then this. What do I mean? So, Abaddon's insane. It takes away all your red hearts, but it gives you six black hearts. And I'm not really interested in anything in here. Is this our last shop? No, we got one more. So I'm just gonna get a key. Key behind door number two. Oh, uh, whatever. It's camo. I'll pick up that many. Abaddon. Oh, Destiny 2. Gotcha. Yeah, so I've played it. I have, um... I, I guess I like the Rogue one. Like, I played it when the game came out. I, I did the... What's it called? The Raid? Where it's like eight people? Where it's like some dude in a big purple place. Uh, I think he drinks like grapes or something. I don't know, he's lore. We shot him with guns. Uh, I liked carrying the ball. If you know what I'm talking about in that raid, you have to like run a, a gauntlet. And I think you instantly die if you like explode with the, the energy cube in your hand. You apply quantum entanglement every time that enemy is attacked with damage that oh yes 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 so that's uh that's how temporal manipulation works i guess it's just that you know just renamed for a different game quantum entanglement yes indeed definitely don't think i need to spend more of our valor dues in the shop here we're probably good I see you. I hear you. I know you're grumpy. Don't do it. Oh, this looks familiar. I guess if you don't want to make this one harder on yourself, make sure you finish one off before you, like, trigger a new one of these guys. I'm just using that as damage. Sorry, damage boosting? Okay, that's pretty cool with me. That's some more damage. A lot of red HP. That's pretty cool. Um, so yeah, th I'm just not gonna spend more money. We're just gonna take it with us. What did I pick up? I guess there was another heart in there. Because our goal is just to fill up the greedy donation machine. Dark bomb! Oh, it delays the enemy's next sig action significantly. You love that the status effects in this have different benefits when applied. So, okay, what does that mean? Sorry, am I a dummy? So, like, you can mix together elements or something? Because you were talking about wind and fire and electricity. Yikes, hit off the bat. Honestly, this is great. We want him to summon his beavers as many as possible. Because we can just farm HP off of it. So I would just... I guess I would want more. So we'll take our damage and then just run them all over with that. So you can see we just farm 4 HP. So all you need to do is uh, get literally one item in this fight. It's pretty chill. Uh, I do have Lilith in lock. So I, I did Lilith and then a Poyon as like my order of things. I haven't unlocked Shopkeeper or Lost. Oh yes, indeed, it is good HP generation. So again, the, the, the malice being when he hits you, you lose money, right? So if your whole goal is to put money in the machine, damage tanking through this fight like I'm clearly doing. Not the best. So we picked up three cents, but we lost four in total there.
Oh, you can do Lilith. Oh, okay. Um, oh, dude, what is flying red hearts? Is it just a general thing? Like, I know sometimes, like, hearts spawn off stuff. Is it just that we're killing so many things? Because I'm not remembering... Maybe it's e the evil up your damage. No. I wish I had, like... Oh, we can do our, our HP boosty thing again. Well, never mind. I'm not allowed to. Fire and wind. Okay. Oh no. Give me the donation. Don't break quickly. And what do you know, nice. guys? It's an orgy in the end zone. That's my favorite. Thank you. Oh, excellent. The razor blade. We were just talking about that. That's going to be really good. Have you heard of the thing where if you continue to play the same character on Greed? Oh, I didn't know that. Or, I don't know. I, I, I could believe that to be real. But I've never had that confirmed. Nor denied. 